to develop type 2 diabetes at the age of 54. Her diabetes has caused her to have cataracts and glaucoma. She has had several surgeries to relieve the high pressure in her eye, but her sight is still highly affected. Many other family members of mine also have type 2 diabetes, which I have had to educate myself about this particular disease. According to the article, Type 2 Diabetes Statistics and Facts, in headline by Cameron So on January 24, 2012, nearly 26 million people in the United States have type 2 diabetes. As shown, type 2 diabetes is a very common illness. However, it can be prevented. There are three main ways to prevent type 2 diabetes. Eating properly, exercising regularly, and maintaining a reasonable body weight. One of the main ways to prevent type 2 diabetes is eating properly. Eating a healthy diet can reduce the risk of developing this illness. Be aware of your food portions. Make good choices by choosing food low in fat, cholesterol, and salt. Eat foods that are high in fiber and whole grains and increase the amount of fruits and vegetables in your diet and decrease the intake of new sugary foods. By eating a balanced diet, you can control your body weight, blood pressure, cholesterol, which all have to deal with diabetes. The second thing you should do is exercise regularly. Inactivity promotes type 2 diabetes. By working your muscles more often and making them work harder, improve their ability to use insulin and absorb glucose. You don't have to be the most athletic person to alleviate the benefits of exercise. The Harvard School of Public Health published an article, Simple Steps to Remain Diabetes, that states findings from nurses, health study and health professional follow-ups study, suggest that walking briefly for a half hour every day can reduce the risk of developing type 2 diabetes by 30%. A simple exercise on a regular basis will do the trick. Having excess weight is the single most important cause of type 2 diabetes, so that is why maintaining a reasonable body weight is so important. Fat cells are resistant to insulin, so being overweight can keep your body from using insulin properly. Being obese makes you 20 to 40 times more likely to develop diabetes than someone with a healthy weight. As I mentioned earlier, eating healthy and physical activity can help you maintain a reasonable body weight, which will help you prevent developing type 2 diabetes. Type 2 diabetes can affect anyone, but it can be prevented. Eating properly, exercising early, and maintaining a reasonable body weight will do just that. It is shown in the WebMD article, Type 2 Diabetes Prevention by Michael Danzinger on August 15, 2012, that people with high risk developing diabetes can reduce their type 2 diabetes by more than 50% by gearing at weight loss and improving physical activity levels. My grandmother lives with this disease every day and it's a life-changing experience for her. But now, having researched and educated not only myself, but my family as well, we can prevent from developing this disease.